everyone and welcome back so yeah valentine's day i hope you don't mind another valentine's day makeup tutorial from me uh using pinks and purples and all that jazz so i hope you will enjoy uh so right now i'm using the stay don't stray uh from benefit as a primer i use this all the time right now and then i will take a uh, battery from anastasia beverly hills palette uh this is the artist palette I rediscovered this palette, <laughs> I can say like this. And I'm using actually a new brush from Hakodo, a new from me. Uh, this is the J5533 brush. I recently bought some new brushes from Hakodo and I'm very excited. So yeah. And then I will take this eyeshadow from Ilamasca. This is a matte eyeshadow. It's called Dizzy. Uh, it's just like a um, cool toned pink type of color. I love it. And I'm using the Hakodo J55 um, 2 2 brush, which again I love for the crease. And this uh, will be the transition color that I'm using. And then again, going back to the artist palette. The Anastasia Beverly Hills Artist Palette. I will take this uh, shade called Dusty Rose. It's like a darker version of DZ, and maybe it has a bit more brown in it. Uh, so I will use this to darken the crease um, a little bit. And then I will go back with my Hakuhodo J5533 brush. Um, to blend all the harsh lines and yeah, I'm applying again buttery a little bit uh, on my brow bone to clean everything and then I will apply this shadow. This is the Anastasia Beverly Hills shadow in Macaroon. I recently received uh, from them their new shadows and I was really excited to use this one. This is like a purplish type of color pinkish purplish type of color <laughs> i don't know how to describe it <laughs> whatever uh it's beautiful and um again from the Anas the artist palette i will use aubergine and aubergine is basically my perfect color <laughs> i can say like this it's just a beautiful dark very dark purple color and i am just using this to darken the outer v with the hagoda j5523 brush and then again i will blend any harsh lines because we don't need any harsh lines for valentine's day especially for valentine's day and then i will reapply of course the macaroon uh, eyeshadow from Anastasia Beverly hills where i need it and then i will take this beautiful highlighter from dior this is the uh glowing pink one this is from the glowing gardens collection this spring collection is i, I love it I love this stuff and yeah I will just highlight my inner corner with this and then I will take this uh, Eve by Eve's conditioning liquid eyeliner to enhance my lash line I always do this step when I don't um, I feel like this helps with uh, false lashes when you don't have like um, you know a cut eye going on and yeah and now I will apply mascara and then my false lashes and I'm using the Lana lashes in Bicera and now for the face I will apply the Moonshot uh, Face Perfection Balm I talked about this in my Korean beauty haul I really like this foundation, it has a medium coverage, a light to medium coverage uh, now the color is a little bit light for me, but mm, I don't care because I still love it. <laughs> so yeah, uh, this is uh, in 101, the lightest shade, but it works. So, you know, I don't care. <laughs> and uh, then I will take my concealer and I'm using a new concealer. This is the uh, Makeup Forever Ultra HD one. I absolutely adore it. Uh, this is in the shade Y23. It's really good. It has a really good coverage, a really like medium to full coverage, and it's very lightweight. So this is what I love about this. It, it has a good coverage and it's lightweight. And um, now I'm taking my uh, Too Cool for School Loose and Sealy Loose Powder. This is in definition. Somebody asked me if I love this more than my Shantikai one. Yes, I do, honey. Yes, I do. It's amazing. 
uh, and now I will apply my blush. This is the Too Cool for School um, from the Art Class Collection. The blush in lavender. It's uh, a lavender color, basically, <laughs> like a cool tone pink. Um, and then I will take again the beautiful Dior highlighter, which I am in love with. And um, yeah, with my Chico Hodo brush, highlighting brush. And then uh, I'm using again my Dolce Gabbana blush in tan as a contour because I still don't have my Kevin O'Quan sculpting powder. So I need to use this one. It's beautiful, but it's not the Kevin O'Quan sculpting powder. So yeah, that's that. <laughs> and now on my bottom lash line, I will apply again all the colors. The DZ Formula Masca and then Dusty Rose. And then I will apply again the uh, inner corner highlighter and I will blend everything as always. And um, on my waterline I will use the Yves Rocher uh, eye coal in this like whitish pinkish type of color. I don't know exactly how it's called and I don't have it near me so sorry about that. Um, and. As a lip product, I will use my cream paint from Moonshot in 101 Pink Squeeze. And I really like it on the lips. It's like, um, it gives me like a satiny, glossy finish. And I think this is really pretty for Valentine's Day. Uh, by the way, the earrings are from ASOS. And yeah, this is the finished look. Thank you for watching. Bye. <laughs>